Hey guys, Bonds here on the PvE, here to talk to you guys about a number of new items which are available on the ARAM map, Howling Abyss. Um, now, it, obviously this is not available on the main sort of uh, Summoner's Rift map, but uh, they are new items, it's kind of interesting, and you know, people play an ARAM game here or there, so I imagine this will affect pretty much everyone at some point, given that these are starting items, so they're sort of like replacements for um, Doran items, and we'll talk about a number of other balance changes towards the end after I finish discussing these, but... Uh, yeah, we have Doran's Horn, or not Doran's, Guardian's Horn, essentially a better Doran's Shield. Uh, we have Guardian's Orb, which is a, basically a better um, Doran's Ring, and then Guardian's Hammer, which is obviously a better Doran's Blade. Um, so yeah, Guardian's Horn, you might remember, that's actually an item that currently exists in Aram, I believe. I haven't built it in a while, but um, whenever I built tank, or whenever I ever got a, a tank character in Aram, I used to build the Guardian's Horn a good amount. So that's just gone, I'm not sure what I think about that, but uh, this is the thing here. Restores 20 health every 5 seconds, so pretty substantial, and blocks 12 damage from attacks per, uh, and spells and champions. 25% 25 uh, effectiveness versus uh, damage over time abilities. Next we have Guardian's Orb, you guys can see the stats right there, pretty basic stuff, just a boatload of stats on it. And uh, next we have Guardian's Hammer, again, boatload of stats on it, better Doran's Blade essentially. So you're basically only, er, you are limited to only one Guardian item per character, as you can see there, so you can't like buy all three for whatever reason if you wanted them. Um, and the old Guardian's Horn just, yeah, does not exist anymore. Uh, you also might notice... That Guardian's Orb uses the old uh, icon for, um, was that Winter's Orb or Orb of Winter? Yeah, Orb of Winter. That item does not exist anymore, as you can see. Orb of, yeah, Winter. It's just not there. Although, interestingly, the old build path to Orb of Winter will still show up in, actually, no, if you click this, Rejuvenation Bead, it still shows up there. So I imagine they'll probably get rid of that soon. Or it'll stay there and they'll never notice it. Not a huge deal in any case, but as you can see, it doesn't build out of anything, but it's still tracking the old build path. Incidentally, the old Guardian Horn doesn't track the old build path at all. See, it's not showing up. Because that was, if I recall correctly, a uh, Rejuve Bead and a Ruby Crystal. Actually, I'm kind of curious. Let's check something here. Does it still track out of this? Nope, it doesn't. Because, yeah, the um, Orb of Winter used to be a Rejuve Bead and I think it was... Yeah, two Rejuve Beads and a Negatron Cloak. It's kind of a weird build pad. I like that item too, incidentally. It was pretty good if you're up against like a huge magic poke team. But uh, yeah, in any case, aside from that, Refillable Potion is now available on ARAM, as you can see right here. Um, which will build a Corrupt Green Potion. So I think, how much do you start, how much gold do you start with in there? I think it's like 1600, right? So I guess you could buy a Guardian item plus a, a Refillable Potion if you really wanted to. Um... Yeah, so that's a thing. Uh, I imagine, yeah, it's just going to change a lot in the, the ARAM play style, I suppose. Uh, also, Oracle's Elixir, I, slash Extract, whatever you want to call it. Uh, this thing now persists through death. If I recall correctly, on the old ARAM, you, if you died, it would disappear. So, um, yeah, there's, it's got that going forward. Also, it attracts people with like that red shadow thing, um, like uh, the trinket does. So there's that, so I guess it's kind of an interesting use for it. Um, less annoying to face Teemos on this map, I imagine, now. Uh, aside from that, in terms of items specifically, uh, now a lot of items are no longer available for purchase in general uh, on this map. Uh, I'll put a big list of it on uh, in the description below if you want to check it out. I'll just list every single item, but I'll quickly go over everything, you know, uh, just kind of as a basic list. Uh, now, overall, it's mainly just the support items are removed and the Dorans, but there are a few other, like, specialty ARAM items that were removed. For example, like, um, Arcane Sweeper. So you see that's no longer there anymore. Arcane Sweeper, so going in alphabetical order plus some um, things that they build out of or into. Arcane Sweeper, uh, Ancient Coin, Nomad's Medallion, uh, Talisman Ascension, Doran's Blade, Doran's Ring, Doran's Shield, Entropy. Uh, Guardian Horn, as I mentioned earlier, Lightbringer, Orb of Winter, as I also mentioned, Relic Shield, Targon's Brace, Face of the Mountain, Spell Thief's Edge, Frost Queen's Claim, Fro uh, Fro no, Frost Fang, Frost Queen's Claim, Wicked Hatchet. Those are all gone now. So, uh, yeah. Number of changes to the ARAM map. <clears throat> if you play a lot of it here, I uh, suppose you have those changes to look forward to. <coughs> Excuse me. Something. I had an oatmeal cookie earlier. I think I have a chunk of it stuck in my throat. Anyway, um... Yeah, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll have to go stream twitch.tv slash bots. Thanks for uh, 
Thanks for watching. Goodbye.